up everybody? How's it going? Uh, it's good to see you. Uh, thanks for watching vlog number two. Okay, what we did this week, uh, a lot of fun. I got to go do a youth group uh, at Hope Chapel in Glendale on Wednesday. And so we'll show you a couple clips of that. And, uh, and then uh, Sunday, we were at a church called The Fountain. So here's what we're gonna do. Uh, uh, we're gonna, we have some really fun planned for this video. Let's see it. Uh, roll that beautiful bean footage. Whoops, sorry. That was the wrong video. Um, I just saw a flamingo suit, so or a flamingo thingy, so I was like, I wanna play with that. Sorry, my, my ADD got in the way, so please continue. What's up, guys? We out here at Hope Chapel in Glendale. It's a Wednesday night. Youth Alive vlog number two. Uh, we're hanging out with some kids right now, so come on, let's go. Boy Danny, right here. Uh, Danny, you want to say something to the camera? <laughs> you can change the world. <laughs> that was very epic. I know. <laughs> That's not even epic. That's right. I like that. So Danny, Danny is the youth pastor here, right? Yep. And uh, uh, you do you do good things. And tell everybody what you, it's about to happen in your life. I'm about to have a kid. I'm about to have a baby. Ooh. Let's go. It is Sunday morning, and uh, where are we at this morning, Brittany? We are at the Fountain in Phoenix. Yes, the Fountain of Life International. Let's go. So we just finished church. Great Sunday. Super great Sunday, wouldn't you say? So great. So now we're headed to uh, Chili's. Uh, if Timmy, Timothy V. Hill, if you're seeing this, this one's for you, you know what I'm saying? Heading to Chili's with the pastors. And it's a great Sunday, man. Um, six, six people made decisions to follow Christ today. So anyway, um, cool things happening. It was a great week, and um, so I think the video you came to this to see was our uh, taco taste test. So my wife and I, um, we're pretty competitive, you know what I mean? And so we decided we're gonna just see um, who knows our taco knowledge better. Um, so, without further ado, thanks for getting to this point. Um, why don't you take a look right now? Uh, I'm gonna count to three. We're gonna just go right into it. You're gonna see my living room. Uh, so here we go. One, two, three. Hello. Hello. Well, welcome to our home. Uh, this is Brittany. Hey. And obviously, I am Christian. Um, Oliver, he um, he. He's happy. That's uh, that's what he's doing. I was gonna make up something, but make make us like bad parents. Um, like he's outside just playing by himself. So here's what we're gonna do. We're we're gonna see. Um, Brittany feels like she knows her tacos really well. Mm. You were just talking all kinds of confident off camera. No, I said two tacos. I know two tacos. Really okay, well. so here's what we've done. Uh, we took five, five fast food tacos, and we're gonna put these blindfolds on, and we're gonna see if we can guess which taco is which, and then we're also gonna uh, rate the tacos on which one we think tastes better. Uh, and then the winner um, of this will get what? I mean, we didn't think that far ahead. Um, but anyhow. The victory of winning. The victory of winning. That's good, I like that. All right, so we're gonna do it, let's go. All right, as you can see, we cannot. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna, we're gonna go for it. So let's try this. Grab it, oh, okay. Okay, all righty, where's the top? Okay, ready, here we go. Interesting, it's so flat. Wow, that's pretty good. So we're trying to do our no carb thing. So this is kind of, <laughs> this is going completely against that. That's really good. I'm taking another bite. Mm. So you ready to guess? Mm. I think so. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. What's your guesses? Burger. Fred, Fredericos. 
I'm, that's my guess and I'm sticking to it. Um, I'm gonna give that on a scale of one to five. I'm gonna give that a three. Um, I'd say a two. Two? A two. It's so flat. I actually really liked it. It's actually, I'm, I'm gonna take the back. I'm gonna do a four. And my guess was Fred Rico's. Okay. All right. All right. All right, round two. Taco number two. Round two, here we go. Okay. Oh. Oh, I think I already know this one. Oh. I'm a big Taco Bell fan, so if I don't guess Taco Bell right, I'm gonna be really sad. Yeah, I'm also gonna rate this one a four. I don't know if I can give it any single one of five, but I like the other one better, so. I feel like I know what this is. I do too. But, like I said, if I'm wrong, because it's like one of my favorite places. I'm 90% positive so I know upset. what this is. All right. All right, y'all ready to guess? Oh, I need to plate all over there. Oh. All right. What'd you rate this one? Um, a, a four. Two fours. Okay, you ready to guess, y'all? Yes. Three, two, one, get it. Taco, Taco Bell. Bell. Boom. Mm -hmm. We are on it. What at if it's not Taco Bell? We're gonna feel so stupid. Okay, round, wait, three? Round three. three. Taco number three. Oh, by the way, really quick. Um, Brittany, mm -hmm. what do you love so much about tacos? Oh, um, well you see, I actually really love the gross fast food tacos over like the authentic tacos. Mmm, that's very American of you. It is very American of me. No, I love uh, Taco Saguaro. If you're watching this, um, I highly doubt you are, but it's Taco Saguaro. Um, I would love for you to give me tacos for life. One day we did a video. Um, we did a video and I had Taco Saguaro food that day. And I thought there was like five of us there. So, oh, surely we could eat a lot of tacos. So I ordered 75 tacos. Oh my lord. <laughs> We didn't eat, but maybe 15. And so, you better believe at the Chambliss house. We had tacos for days. Anyway, round three, here we go. Where are we at? Oh, right Okay, here. all right, here we go. Okay. This oh. one also feels very, like, oh, wow. soggy, sog-tastic. Well, it's been sitting for a little time. This one's really thick. Okay. Here we go, uno, dos, tres. Ah. Ew. The greasy slime factor is real. The lettuce is so slimy. This taco sucks. Ew. This is the taco you eat if you have low respect for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you ready to guess? He also said that about Taco Bell. So Wait, we gotta rate it first. Oh, okay, y'all ready? That's a one. Yeah, that's totally a one. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Three, two, what Burger Bowl. King. Fred Rico's. And the only reason why I say that is because the meat's different. Okay. Round, wait, was this four? Four. I'm a really bad counter. Round number four. Here we go. Where is it at? Oh. This one is, feels like the first one. It does. Oh my god, it's about to mess me up a little bit. Alright, okay. here we go. One, two, three, go. You know, I have thought, you know how Americans made hot dogs and they have to twist their head sideways to eat a hot dog? I wonder if Hispanic people are like, hey, we want to have food that we can do that too as well. Let's make tacos. No. Probably should cut that out, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Stay in it. Um, right. Hold on, I'm going to take another bite. This one's kind of good. You know, Hmm. I like this one. I've never had a Jack in the Box or a Del Taco or a Burger King taco. Mm. So, yeah, I forgot about Del Taco. I don't know. I'm gonna take it one more bite. I have been told Jack in the Box tacos are actually really bomb. I might eat this whole thing. This is really good. Calm yourself. Here we go. Alright, I'm gonna rate it as a. Um... I'm doing a four. Yeah, I'm gonna go five. That's my favorite one so far. Wow. Are you ready to guess? Mm hmm. All right, three, <sighs> two, one, rate him. Del Taco. Del yes. Taco. 
Del I Taco. would say the same. Del Taco. I should have went with Jack in the Box. Yeah. Just to be opposite of you. Fun fact, you know the Jack in the Box is open 24 hours? Okay, here we go. Round five. It's the, the last, last taco. taco. And I feel like I'm beating Brittany. I don't feel the same. Well, time um, will tell. Fun fact, I usually win a lot of stuff. I mean, you a lot of stuff. In our marriage. In our but... marriage, but. <laughs> it's a joke. Also, okay. but for also fun fact, when mm. I'm right, it really bothers her. <laughs> Accurate. All right, okay. here we go, cheers. <laughs> here we go. Oh. <laughs> 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 Dude, this tastes like booty. Um, I think it's just the lettuce is really, like, because it's not fresh. Ugh. I think the lettuce is kind of a tad slimy, but it's nothing compared to that one. Extra point if you eat it all. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah. I do not have time for the toilet today. I'm kind of trying to feel it out. That was disgusting. Yeah. That made me want to be like. Worse than the other one with Ugh. the slime? I might give that one a negative score. <laughs> oh, bad. I give it probably a, a one. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a one too. Ready to guess? Yeah. Three, two, one, guess. Jack, Jack in the, the box. box. All right, so we're gonna take off our blindfolds, see what we have in front of us, and uh, we're gonna see a one. You ready? Yep. All right, here we go. Blindfolds coming off. Okay, obviously, my obviously the one I like the most. I ate the whole thing. Um, I feel good. Um, yeah, I feel I feel better. I think I won. <laughs> well, even if I lost, I still won because I had you. Mm, Sorry, that's cheap. You guys don't care about us. All right, so I already know for a fact I got this one wrong. But anyway, so Nina, why don't you tell us what we are our scores or the what taco we like the best? All right, the taco that you guys liked the least, mm. you guys both scored a one on, and it's Frederico's and Del Taco. Ooh. Mm, Frederico's, uh, this is terrible. Uh, I would rather, like, I think my son's diaper is your ground beef. I'm just throwing that out there. I'm sorry, it's not good. It's shredded beef, but uh, yeah. <laughs> No, I think it was just the lettuce, and it wasn't fresh, so the lettuce really slimed. If this was if this was college, Carly Carly Gregory would be like this. Oh, vom! <laughs> <laughs> if you're watching, you're welcome. Uh, All right, which, which one was our we like, score the highest? All right, you guys scored a nine on Jack in the Box. Woo! This is the one I ate the whole thing. Obviously, Fantastic. Because there's only one left. Yeah, I ate the whole thing. I might eat that one too. Sweet. <laughs> All right, so. Who won? All right, the winner is Brittany. She guessed three correct, Dang. and Christian guessed one correct. Oh, <laughs> womp, womp, womp. Brittany is indeed the taco queen. Dang. I am the taco queen. Dang it! Well, it's a bummer. Mhm. Mm well, I'll win next time. So hey, here's what we'll do. If you like this, you want to see more of this type of stuff. I want to make you guys laugh. So if you want to see more stuff like this. Um, comment below, let us know what like, you would like to see us do, or whatever, whatever else, and be sure to comment, be sure to subscribe, be sure to share this. So there you have it, that was it. Um, I'm really sad that my wife won, but she did. She knows her tacos, I guess. Here's my thought behind this silliness of this vlog, is Brittany and I, we just have a personality that's crazy in general, you know what I mean? And I think just because we're doing ministry doesn't mean we, we shouldn't be having fun. And it's called Youth Alive for a reason. And so we want to bring life to people. And I want also, I also want to give you a, an insider look on my family and what we do. And we love to have fun here in the Chambliss house. So thank you so much. For those of you who support this ministry, um, I also want you to know you're genuinely uh, helping us reach every student, every school. You're helping us encourage pastors and youth pastors. And uh, we're getting campus clubs started like crazy, like never before. The Youth Alive One Day. All of these things that you help support. So thank you so much for supporting Youth Alive. And to continue this type of stuff, um, 
I mean, if there's anybody watching this right now that you're thinking about maybe supporting us on a monthly basis, it'd be awesome and it would be so appreciated. There's, I have a vision out the wazoo for next school year and especially next calendar year for what I, what I believe God's gonna do. Um, so if you ever consider, um, we'll have a link below, uh, an area where you can give either on a monthly basis or on an individual or, um, sorry, a single single donation. If you would be interested in that, there's a link down in the description before, for you and it would just mean the world. And thank you for those who are and continue to be faithful in that. It means the world. Anyway, it's so much fun to do what we do. So thank you so much for everything. We love you and let's reach every student and every school.